Chad Selsky, about two or three months old. Here we're flying over Grandpa Elliot's Peach Orchard back in about 1972, I believe. I was flying the plane alone, trying to take these pictures. It was kind of hard to do at the same time. Here's a wing over or a chandelle. I'm trying to look out the camera and concentrate what I was doing. It was rather hard. I didn't have my pilot's license at this time, just student pilot. And a spin that's coming up, where we actually put the aircraft into a spin, that was really hard to do. December in 1971, Russ and Grace is coming up to visit your Grandma and Grandpa Elliot, and Grandma Nutter is with him also. Your Uncle Russ there, or Great Uncle Russ, he lost his leg in a uh, accident. He got electrocuted when a, he was working construction and a crane hit a uh, electrical line. He just had to keep chopping his leg off up a little further and up a little further, so he walks with one leg at this point in time. They couldn't make up their mind if they, what they were going to do. They haven't been up for a while. Grace sure had a lot to talk about that day. I'm not sure what she was talking about, but she sure was just a jabbering away all the time that she was up there and telling stories and stuff. Dang cameraman can't keep the camera still. Grandma Nutter. For great grandma nutter to you kids. Christmas 1971. They had the Christmas uh, down in the basement there for some reason. Can't remember why. Here is uh, David Nutter, one of your cousins. Butch Nutter. And far left is Patricia Nutter. And of course, everybody got the uh, old photograph box out and was looking at the old photos. That's your Uncle Bernard, or great Uncle Bernard Nutter. Of course, your grandmother. Grandpa didn't like having this picture taken. trying to show pictures of me when I was very young uh, with water holes and stuff and just diapers.
my sister Darlene playing the organ for some reason she uh, didn't like the camera your great grandpa Joe Elliott he died of uh, Alzheimer's disease Grandma Nutter of course Bernard and his wife Evelyn Nutter and there is Grandma Elliot and I put in a uh, clip of her because she's very camera shy there she be Grandpa Elliot was taking this uh, short clip that we have here of Grandma and she was just chewing him out telling him stop wasting my film and everything and he just wasn't paying a bit of attention to what she was telling him and she was just carrying on and on and on Why does he keep pointing the camera down there like that? This is my 1971 Super Beetle I had. It was uh, at this point in time uh, about brand new, pretty close to being brand new. I believe back in about 1972, my friend Dave Plummer and I, we decided we were going to take a trip out to uh, Arizona, and these are some shots of that trip. One thing about this trip, uh, we took the southern route down, going through uh, northern uh, Texas and stuff. These scenes are actually uh, of either New Mexico or Arizona itself. And Dave uh, Plummer had long hair as we was going through the northern part of uh, Texas seemed like every town, small town that we come to, uh, we stopped maybe now and then and had uh, dinner. And the cops would just kind of follow us all the way through town, kind of keeping an eye on us. One thing interesting about this trip, uh, we didn't have much money back then. Dave had a hundred bucks and I had a hundred bucks, and we took this entire trip out west. Uh, on two hundred dollars between the both of us well when we got to uh... arizona we kinda ran out of money and we had that really high tail it back we came back uh, i believe with just a few bucks in our pocket after we made it back to michigan Mom and Dad would quite often in the fall take uh, fishing trips up north. They'd go fishing after walleye. Dad's telling about uh, a big one that they tried to get in a boat and he couldn't get it in that small net. 